Hello, I'm Sveta and you're in my blog about life in Russia. To dip or not to dip? That's the question, especially in Russia. In the USSR, the service was horrible. Uh, I don't remember that because I was really little at that time, but I know that because of Soviet movies like Give Me the Book of Complaints or Station for Two. If you're interested in Soviet life, then you can watch those movies. You can find them with subtitles. In modern Russia, service is fine, and we have many cafes and restaurants, and people working there um, provide quite good service. So do we give tips to waiters and to other people? I can divide Russians into three categories. The first one is around 25% of all Russians. They never give any tips. And it's like their position. They think that a waiter has his salary. And if he is not happy about the size of that salary, then he should just change work. And they also think that why should we give tips to the waiters? Because other people in service, they work without any tips. And they do not complain and then don't ask you to give them some additional money. So, the second group, they always give tips to the waiters. Because they, th they also think that the salary of the waiters is really low. And they just, like, pity the waiters. They, that's why they always leave them some additional money. And also because of that, because of the salary, you can rarely see a waiter older than 40 years old in Russia. Because it is considered to be a, stu a student work or a work for very young people. Because they don't know what to do in their life yet and they can just temporarily work as waiters. So the third group of Russians, they give tips according to the level of the service provided. It means that if they liked what the waiter did for them, then they give the tip. If they don't like, then they don't tip. In Russia, the size of the tip is from 5 to 15 percent, but on average is, it is 10 percent. If the bill was really big, then you can leave 5 percent. If the bill was small, then you can leave 15% or even 20%, just as you want. If you paid by cash and the waiter gave you the change, then if you leave him only the coins, then he may not like it. But some of the waiters are okay with both coins and banknotes. But of course, they all, all prefer banknotes because the banknotes are much bigger and much more convenient. And it means that you can tip anybody you want in Russia, but normally we only tip waiters. It's very rare that you leave additional money to a taxi driver or to somebody working at a barber shop. But of course, if you live in Russia and you often go to the same specialist and you have friendly relationships, then you may leave him some money just as you want because they will they're going to take them no one is going to refuse uh, some extra money and it all means that russian russians are not like japanese or south koreans because in those countries tipping is forbidden and we are not like uh, americans because as far as i know they are really crazy about tipping it means that you must leave a tip and also uh, the tip is not 10%, it's often around 20% or even 30%. At least that's what I heard from other YouTubers. And it's funny that when I was young, I went to Germany and I had no idea about this concept of tipping. And that's why the whole time I was living there, I didn't give any tip to anybody. And now I'm ashamed a little bit about that. But just a little bit, because I really didn't know. As far as I know, some foreigners complain about Russian service. They say it is bad and so on. 
but in fact it's not bad it's, it's fine just you should not expect a big smile from a waiter because they do not pretend to be really happy to see you they just do their job as a connection between you and the kitchen they don't look happy not because they hate you just because this is the way they look and i also want to give you a tip maybe it's international i don't know but i just want to say that if you go to a Russian restaurant and you sit down and you choose what you want to order then you should leave your ears open and if you hear that a waiter suggests somebody a certain dish and then he suggests the same dish to you then you should not order it because obviously this is not the best dish at the restaurant it is just that a certain component of that dish is about to go bad and the waiter just wants to sell it out as fast as possible because he's gonna uh, receive some more additional money from that and you have to be careful so to summarize it um, Russians give and receive tips it's absolutely fine and you can tip anybody you want and the average tip is 10% if you want to give more, it's absolutely fine. And that's all for today. If you want to know more about life in Russia, then subscribe to this channel. And bye-bye.